So let's talk about why I hate the jump mat. And this video is exactly why. So this kid's claiming he's got a 40 inch vertical. I'm actually going to blame the coach on this more so than the kid. Respect the hustle kid. But the jump mat is just measuring the hang time that you have in the air. So it's going to measure how long your feet are not on that pad. It's got a starting point and it's got an any point. Anything you do to manipulate that time is going to then read out on the display a higher vertical than what you probably actually have. So if you could jump with your legs straight and land with them exactly straight, you will have a pretty accurate measurement. But if you bring your feet forward, you bend your knees or you go to catch it in a much deeper squat position than when you started, your displacement of your hips is going to be different and you're altering that to change that number. I've seen some 40 inch verticals in my day and I can tell you right now that is not 40 inches. Go put up three and a half feet on a measuring stick or whatever and you can tell that that kid's feet are not leaving the ground three and a half feet. So again, this can be a great way to measure your force if you use those numbers on the jump mat, but to measure the vertical, it does have flaws unless if the testing is actually done methodically, which in this video, it is not. This is why I like the old school Vertec. I think it's much harder to cheat, especially if you really force kids to reach, then they're gonna have a much harder time. And if anything, you're chopping numbers down versus raising their numbers up, which in this video is exacerbating.